with an old dependable pickup as his preferred form of transportation, filmmaker, author, and songwriter Howie Klausner traverses the country on a quest in search of, well, anything and everything. All along, dispensing words of wisdom about, yep, anything and everything. like talk shows. Uh, they, they like relationships and and feelings. I, I like to find out how things work. I, I like trucks and, and airplanes and trains and gravel, rocks and dirt. That is one man's quest. Join me, won't you? what I'm looking for. I, I'm not sure if this is it, but I've been driving all day in malls and parking lots and people and I just got to get out. I got to see something that's a little bit different than the same old stuff that I see every day. Something like this. Guys piling rocks with machines and trucks and hammers. Yes! is that most people, it, it doesn't really matter if they call themselves a Democrat or a Republican, are pretty much like in that middle zone, either a little bit to the right or a little bit to the left. You know, you got, you got the nutcases on the way far right and the nutcases on the way far left. And, I mean, they make for good radio and good TV, but, you know, I mean... It's really not rocket science. I mean, you know, it's just common sense. People taking care of each other, doing their business, and not having to give all their money away. I, I don't understand why that's so difficult and why people couldn't possibly, you know, recognize. What the hell is that? Chris. Chris, how you doing? I'm good, man. This is a show called One Man's Quest. And we're just driving around finding guy stuff, and we were just driving down the street. It's my salute to factory men and women who have worked in other plants and industries. I have myself, and I can relate to that. An American industry has changed. Our plants and factories are closing down, so this is a monument to salute American industry. This man's name is Rusty. It will be on his shirt pocket, okay? The <laughs> company name is going to be American Industry. His last name is Mechanism. Rusty Mechanism is what American Industry has become. This piece is titled Clocking Out. He's gonna have, this is his lunch box on the ground. We're close, I hope to finish this spring. I can't be the only person who's driven by and stopped and said, what is this? No, thing? every day somebody stops it. <laughs> every day police have come and they're, what are you doing? And they'll stay 30, 40 minutes. <laughs> Man, what is this place? Well, this is my shop and uh, I build curtain rods. This is what I do for a living. Okay. Um, when, you're, when you're not making the robot. When robots. I'm not making creative other things like right. uh, my statue. Or, right, right. What is this thing? This is a... This is why it's warm in here. This is a, is a wood stove. Man, it is hot. I and can it, feel uh, it. Yeah, well, we have a good, good fire going in the wood stove. You know, I, I got to tell you. Complete I, with an oven on top. I was going to say, I smell something and I'm starving. Is, can I have something to eat? Well, you won't believe it, but it'll, it'll be a couple more hours yet. But we've got beer can chicken. Okay, I wasn't uh, uh, Now, this is a man's wrench. <laughs> all right. 
the same, you know, this is not your little true value hardware, you know, wife gonna fix the curtain rod. Sorry, I mean, this is, you don't fix curtain rods with a wrench like this. I can take the lens off of the camera. Well, looks like you're warm enough to keep working there, Chris. Thanks a lot. We really up, appreciate Tyler. you showing us around your shop here and showing us the factory, man. Showing how real people work here in Franklin, Tennessee. Thanks for coming. Good to have you. You bet, man. I'll see you next time around. All right. A 20 foot robot in the middle of Franklin, Tennessee. What are the chances of that? I love this job. I love driving around looking at things and finding out how stuff works and seeing what other people do. This is Howie Clausner saying, see you next week on One Man's Quest. I think my trust starts.